Hello, my name is Eric Young. I'm the program director at Sweetbriar Nature Center. A lifetime nature lover and uh, outdoor enthusiast. A habitat is a place that an animal lives, animal and plant life, where it meets its needs for survival, food, water, shelter, and space. Well, you might say an ecosystem is loaded with habitats. It's a natural place where living things and non-living things interact to get what they need to survive. So it would include everything, the animals, the plants, the weather, the uh, rocks, the water, all of it together makes up the ecosystem rather than just the animals and the plants. The ecosystem is actually a more accurate term for places like uh, forests and fields and rivers and streams, wetlands, and many of the others we're going to talk about. I guess you would say there's two things that influence the ecosystems here on Long Island. The obvious one is that we're surrounded by water. So that influences everything on Long Island. Having the Long Island Sound on one side and the Atlantic Ocean on the other and a few freshwater rivers that, uh, that come inland. And the second thing is that Long Island was formed in such a unique way thousands of years ago by glaciers. So we are basically a dump of a glacier. Rocks and sand that were left behind by glaciers thousands of years ago. And that obviously has an influence on what kind of plant and animal life can survive here. Okay, we're, we're talking about pine barrens, which are unique to Long Island and a couple other places. We're talking about the Hempstead Plains, a little remnant of prairie that's left over on Long Island. We've got woodlands, uh, wetlands, and seashore. Those are the five things. Obviously, seashore is a biggie because our whole island is covered, uh, surrounded by seashore. Uh, so if we start with the pine barrens, because it's probably the most unique ecosystem or habitat that we have here on Long Island. 